<clears throat> Hi everybody and welcome to TWF uh, Explosion and today we have the decision to make. Well today Angel says we decide we have to retire the TWF Women's Heavyweight Championship. Not because we don't have a lot of women action figures and dolls, don't get me wrong. It's because it's becoming very apparent lately, or over the years, where it's becoming an attraction. And don't, don't admit, the women's champion, the TWF Women's Heavyweight Championship, did have a lot of good moments. It passed its time, you know. You rarely ever see it on any of our programs anymore. It always seems to be an attraction when it happens. So as is right now, the last TWF Women's Heavyweight Champion is Gil Kim. But the women can still go for either the heavyweight, light heavyweight, hardcore, Allegheny Championship or Tag Team Championship. So you can't say that the women aren't going to be pushed because they will be and somebody has been lobbering for some time to get themselves in the heavyweight title picture someone who says they're going to challenge Godzilla but well, I don't know for which one felt because he happened the Godzilla happens to be both the heavyweight and light heavyweight but somebody out there has been asking for uh, some time to be put in that position. Wait a minute, it's AJ Lee. She must, yeah, that would be me. As you know, I'm multi-time TWF Women's Heavyweight Champion. Sadly, that belt has now been retired by YouTube. Um, and also, I just want to say that, yeah, I was the one lobbying to fight Godzilla for the TWF Heavyweight Championship. Well, it is true, Spike says. You happen, you are a former TWF Women's Heavyweight Champion, a former multi-time TWF Women's Heavyweight Champion, and a one-time TWF Heavyweight Champion. It is true. You won it in a battle royal and then lost it to Brock Lesnar not too long afterwards. So I think, oh, sorry, Brad. I think that you can meet Godzilla for the TWF Heavyweight Championship. Now, somebody else out there might actually want to try to go. Now, the question. That's cool. Yeah, Angel says, now Godzilla finally got his number one contender name. But there's going to be a problem, AJ Lee says, because you know CM Punk and Daniel Bryan and Captain Jack Sparrow to put claims on the belt. Everybody has claims on the belt, Angel says. Every action figure and doll and figurine to a certain point has claims on the belt. Well, how does Gil Kill? How does Gil Kim feel about the fact that the belt that she currently holds is no longer around anymore? Upset, I would imagine. Angel says. Actually, she got in our face earlier today and said, "How dare you do this to me?" But hey, okay, you're number one contender for Godzilla's TWF World Heavyweight Championship. Thank you. Well, you know, Angel, it wasn't one of those most popular decisions you ever made. You know, Angel, you could easily keep the belt going. You know, you could just use the excuse that uh, that it, that that it was being that it was no longer was important or it was no longer being used. Oh, it's true. We only saw them defend the belt every once in a while. But you can make the argument for every one of those belts. Hey, asshole, I know you're the director of wrestling operations now, and Spike's the director of operations. How dare you end the TWF Women's Heavyweight Championship? 
Gil, I understand your frustration, but that but the decision to end the belt was made on the fact that the belt has no the belt's no longer being defended on the program. I mean, you rarely ever see the TWF Women's Heavyweight Championship anymore. Yeah, that's not true. What are you going to do? Give Lita a rain check? I already informed Lita that she can go for one of the other major belts. Heavyweight, light heavyweight, hardcore Allegheny. Ch Allegheny County. Oh, so that's what you're going to do. Let me guess, Gil Kim says. Yeah. So, what, what can I do for you? You bring back the belt. No, we ain't bringing back the belt. I'm sorry. The belt been retired. Had a good run. I think we crowned some pretty good women or divas or knockouts or vixens, the way you want to call them. The belt had a pretty good, decent run, you know. But over time, it started to lose its importance. And if we just kept doing it, it would just be bad. And plus, you know, it's not fair. Because, you know, women could go for other belts, too. Well, then, why don't you sign me up? Because I want to go against Godzilla for the TWF Light Heavyweight Championship. No, the Heavyweight champ. AJ Lee's already put her name on the Heavyweight Championship. But if you want to go for the Light Heavyweight Championship, that's good. Yeah, Spike says... There's something funny about seeing Gil Kim running around for the light heavyweight champion. Oh, you, you, you that big that's real funny. No, 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 seriously, Spike says. There have been some great light heavyweight champions, like Godzilla, for example, um, Batman. Um, who else? Trying to figure out people who won that belt. There were some pretty good people. Kurt Angle. Um... Zena, yeah, she won that. That was the first belt she ever won. You're going to pay for this. It was my belt, you jerks. And I guess some people are just not happy with the decisions that are being going on here. But here apparently is not, but apparently this is not, you know, uh oh. What can I do for you? Uh, at, what can I do for you? So, what am I gonna do since I'm no longer, since there no longer is a TWF uh, women's division anymore? Meaning, I'm no longer the general manager of that position anymore. Well, I could see you could always go for one another multiple belts. You always said you want to have that match against Aries, right? Well, why don't, you, why don't you have that match against Aries? Uh, Angel said. And look at this way, Spike says. It'll be great to watch you beat Aries up. Because we all know Aries has not really done anything good lately. And you know, you do hate him as much as Xena does, or as much as Hercules does. Yeah, that doesn't really answer quite what I'm going to do, though. You know. We'll have to find something for you to do. Well, people, it's, it's sad but true, but there, the TWF Women's Division is no more. Um, you know, Women's Division is no more, and it will be missed. But remember, it did have a good run. You know... It did make some people's careers. Well, we hope you enjoyed this episode of TWF Explosion. We apologize for the lack of any wrestling. Well, then we'll make up for that on Superstar. That's it. We'll see you tomorrow.